welcome to this tutorial today we will customize jana theme jana theme uh, this is the theme for blogger if you are a blogger and uh, you you are looking for good theme uh, a lot of themes are up there but we will go through a step by step in jana theme we will install this theme first uh, first of all if you have already wordpress and uh, you have to go this option appears and themes click on add new let's add our theme first okay let me check my theme once you have a theme file just you drag your theme file or you can pick your theme where you save in your local machine okay just click install now we will install first our theme it takes some time it's depend on your uh, internet connection how's your internet connection so it takes some time so you have to wait for till it already so i have already jenna theme files if you have already uh, if you did not have it will install and you have to click on replace active or if you first time uploading this just only activate this theme that's all okay so now we will go through step by step we will install demo and everything I will, I will show you later how our theme how our website will look like after this okay so okay let me go to install plugin first which is very important okay first we will install this all required plugin let me go to first my um, to a plugins old plugins i have a lot of plugins here i have to remove those because we don't need any more okay cloud library which is belong to a newspaper team let me deactivate all other plugin which we don't need anymore because we are not using the other theme right now because we are going to install new theme so we we require new new plugin which comes with the theme okay so let me delete this all so uh, we only keep some important uh, plugins which uh, help you in performance as well if you have a lot of plugins uh, it, uh, it it impact it impact on your website your website loading very slow okay if you just only i recommend keep only important plugins here okay so let me go back to our theme okay so now here let me choose uh required okay let me i think we need all these off okay let me click install it takes some time we will install its theme step by step so it, it i think it already done let me go back so now we will activate those all the themes okay together click activate and apply so now our themes already activated okay here are some other uh, plugins uh, which jana theme recommend you you can uh, uh, to increase the performance i will show you this uh, later on as well okay so now next option we have install demos let me check my website how it look like now so you can see it already has structure but it has nothing uh, on the front page okay so how we will do we will install the demo first okay uh, for the demo i will recommend if you already have content or if you already have the post uh, the images if you are uh, already uh, have website blogging website since old time and you have already content do not uh, copy this demo content with uh, includes the content like uh, let when we click on import it will ask you you want to import uh, all all the demo images or demo post you don't need to import those we only need to import the structure i will show you let me uninstall the demo data first okay so we will fresh import demo now okay click install demo again now we have demo a lot of options here uh, you have dark here uh, you have for your recipes and tips creative 
and uh, you have newspaper, you have health, videos, any type of uh, a demo or any type of structure you like, if you have personal blog, you can uh, choose this one as well, okay? So that's depend on you, which one you like and you, which demo you want to import here, okay? Let me choose this first one. Let me click on import, okay? Click on import. It takes some time. It depends on your internet connection. If your internet connection is good, it takes some, um, it takes small time. Okay, you don't need to worry about it. Sometimes our internet is fast and uh, it takes some um, only uh, only one minute, two minute, mo maximum one or two minute. Okay. Now later on, I will show you how our website look like and how we customize uh, step by step the options the front page how we customize uh, post page uh, um, uh, post page and uh, categories uh, tags everything i will show you in this video so stay with me we will wait till it finish and important thing is here do not refresh your page if you refresh your page your your it possible your uh, your demo data will not be uh, import properly. It may crash your theme may crash or you you cannot get the your theme properly in front page like this. You will get something like this the error in the front page. So I will recommend just uh, keep wait till it finish the processing. Okay, do not refresh this please. I recommend. So we have done our demo data already done here now let's click on visit site let's check our website how it look like wow so nice you can see guys our website look very great very nice okay now let's go to theme options which is important we will customize we will set our theme logo everything here in theme option if you did not find this theme option, you can go to your WordPress and choose Jana option and theme option. Okay. New features we have. Okay. We will skip this. Okay. So now, first option we have here uh, general. Let's go to general. Time ago format. Okay. Like uh, if you click on. Uh, any post here you will see here 12 seconds ago one minute ago here the time the post time when we upload that post or you can disable it or traditional you can keep it okay that's depend on you bed crumbs i would recommend to enable it okay and now if you have any header code like sometime uh, uh, any third party provider ask you to upload uh, that code into header, you can just uh, uh, put that code here and save changes. Okay. You don't need to have uh, added all the thing. You can simply um, put your code here. Let's go to header first. Layout. Layout, you can choose full layout you want. You boxed. Full layout like this is a box type. Okay. Full layout will be up to here. Complete screen. Okay, boxed frame. Okay. okay, you want loader icon, loader icon. You want this icon, or you, you can choose if this is very simple. Okay, just make sure every time you edit anything, save changes. Okay, I recommend this. Let's go to header now. Header, we have header here. What type of layout you want in header? Layout number two, layout number three, layout number four. So, let's go to go with layout number one okay now main nav menu main nav menu is here this one main menu this is a main menu okay world tech lifestyle this is the main nav menu okay dark skin dark skin in the menu you can see here the dark skin it's dark skin you, know? you want to keep it or you want to remove you can disable it box layout so our theme has a box layout so we will keep our menu box layout as well 
main nav components like search this one here we have a search option here in the front of the menu this is this option okay so we can enable this or disable it okay so now we have a random article button this button here random article we will click this we will see random articles we keep scrolling we will see random articles okay this is the option if you if someone any visitor on your website they want to see random article on your website which are most uh, popular which are most uh, uh, popular uh, which are most uh, just uh, recently added that's depend on the your viewer if they if they do not do not want to go uh, category wise or step by step they can simply click this random article okay now let's go to login if your website has login option i will recommend to enable this let me show you when i uh, enable this and let me text it login and save changes i will refresh it your login uh, button will be shown here somewhere if you did not see like that this here we got our login menu here this is pretty simple so my website has no any uh, login option so i disable it light and dark skin switcher i will definitely enable it so so viewers can uh, uh, enable the dark theme dark option I will show you just now here this is a dark theme they want to keep dark theme or light theme that's depend on them okay I will provide this option social media icon I will yes I want to uh, I want to enable it okay let's refresh again so social media menu will be shown here here but we already has in the header section so we don't need to show social media uh, uh, menus here in the down front of. So if you do not see the uh, upper upper menu, the social media, you, you can enable it here. But if you already have, do no, uh, no need to show in the uh, in the front of menu. Okay. So now next option we have logo. Very important. Okay. Let me see if I have a logo, and I will let you know what logo we need what size we need okay so here we need logo logo width 299 logo height 49 okay so now how we how we will if we we, we do not we do not have any logo and we want to customize logo same like this size how we will do this is the logo width 299 you will go to canva you can use free account of canva Click on create design custom size. In custom size width, we will choose 299. It's width. Okay. It's width. So logo height is only 49. So we will hide 49. We will click create new design. Let's create our logo. Okay. So now what logo color? Uh, I think it's a uh, dark, it's gray color, I think, okay, you can choose any color you want, okay, let me search logo, we will get, pick some great logo, okay, here, blogging boss my website name. okay let me make it bigger this is how simple you can make your logo and I will keep this uh, little dark okay, let me make it drop block 
So this is how you can create your blogging logo. Okay. So click on download PNG. You will download PNG. Click on download. Now we will upload our logo into our theme section. Okay. We will go back to our theme here. Upload. We will drag our logo from the downside to our website area. Okay. Select. So here we already choose our logo and here we will again choose our same logo. Now click save changes. Now we have set our theme already. Let's refresh it. You can see how nice it looks like. Blogging boss. Okay. This is how you can start from the logo. Let's go to next option. So if your website did not see the logo or have any uh, any issue with your logo, you can uh, enter your website name here instead of a logo. Uh, website will show your this name there. Okay, if if some issue in uh, showing this picture here sometime or uh, due to internet issues, and they will see here the name of your website. So for the mobile phone, you can upload same logo. I want to keep same logo. Keep. Save changes. Okay. Now let's go to the next option, sticky menu. Sticky menu here, this menu, sticky menu, sticky menu, okay. Let's go to sticky menu logo. If you want to enable sticky menu logo, you can enable it and you can uh, customize your logo in the sticky menu, okay, save changes. Footer option. Footer option, I have choose four borders here. You can keep one, two, three, four. But I will recommend, let me show you in the footer. Here, this is four sections. One, two, three, four. Follow us, tags, modify post, most view post. These are four sections. So, I will keep four. Second footer visit area, three this one down here you can show add here if you are unable adsense here and you can uh, write about your theme between and for your news a newsletter okay so if you do not want to enable this as uh, you want to only four section you can disable it okay copyright area enable yeah i want to enable it this one here down and i want to uh, show my website name here so, okay, what we will do, we will find here this, this name after no follow opener, like you will see uh, Jana theme by tag div, okay, here this one, the heart Jana theme by tag div, I want to change this to my website name, so what I will do, I will simply blogging box and I will save changes. I will refresh my page and I will show you, you will see our website name here. We will scroll down here, you can see blogging boss. So how you can keep changes here. Now, uh, you want to uh, back to top button, this button here, the, uh, the blue button, it will immediately bring your viewer to the top of your website. Okay, you can keep it enabled. Save changes. Let's go to next option. We have blocks. The blocks, let me show you. Here, these are the blocks. Trending news, world, travel, game, food. These are this section, complete section called block. Okay. In block, what type of uh, head style you want? Let me show you how it means. I want to show this black title, black title, save changes. Now our, this option here, it will become into black, like that. This is black now, it looks more nice, okay. 
now keep scroll you can keep disable this uh, if you do not want uh, author meta name you can keep disable disable comment number meta you can disable it you can disable the other options as well like view number meta you don't want to show the views how many views your post has you can disable it okay this is a simple only this option available and the rounder you you want to keep it rounder like this is square now here from here here this is the square okay i would recommend square bordered so achieved so you can look this setting achieves it's belong to your post like category page like let me show you let me go to any category click on uh, food category let me check. this is the demo content later on i will show you how you can add it okay every category you will go let me show you post achieve i will click any post here let me click this post in the post you will see there is no any sidebar but here when we scroll down we have sidebar whether popular post this is called achieve post achieve when you scroll down you will see other page search page every uh, every achieve here okay like uh, default layout you want to show classic category page setting you want to show classic as well here category description the description here in the starting in the category like uh, i will go to this lifestyle category let me show you okay here this is the description in lifestyle category you can keep it enabled read more button this button here read more you can keep it enable or disable um pagination you can next and previous you uh, if customer want to show this option uh, they want to see next page you can keep it enable and save changes this is the simple options okay let me go to the important options uh, which you really need to enable for your for your theme this is a single post page a single post page when you go to any single post this is a single post so what option you want the uh, customer can see on the on your single post okay like a general post format show the feature image this one big image you want to show bigger image this one here from the starting the post image so uh, post author box when customer scroll down they will see the author name you will see the author box here admin this is the author box you want to show your name here as a author who write this post you can keep it enabled otherwise off it um next and previous post yeah i will recommend keep it enabled in post responsive tables you keep it enable okay category enable tags enable here categories this is the tag i want to keep it enable so customer will click any of the tag they will directly visit to that specific tag how many post belong to that that tag you will they will see all the post okay so post meta area that this area meta area so author i don't want to show myself date i want to show the date comment yeah definitely views how many uh, people already view our post when they scroll up starting they will see this red button red red views here 5804 this is the views how many people watch our post estimate reading time this time 16 minute uh 6 uh, minute to read okay so this is just estimated time you want to keep options enable or disable it's depend on you newsletter you want to enable news i will recommend yes you uh, keep enable this newsletter this one 
so customer can directly subscribe okay related post related post these are all related articles down you want to show yeah i recommend keep it enabled how many posts do you want to show three these are three posts in the related articles you want you can change to four how many you want to show here and save changes so important option here i want to show you in this theme is uh, here advanced i want to show you important options here which are which really you have to look look at performance let me let me go to direct to performance which is really important for your team okay so you can follow my settings here so first of all or optimize css delivery we will start from here yes we we want to optimize css delivery it it it, it make it make a fast your team inline yeah we want to inline all the css codes okay G, load js file therefore yeah enable it magnify html yeah enable it yeah these are some important settings in the performance disable font also okay you don't want to show the google uh, fonts uh, you can disable it okay lazy load for image L yeah i always recommend to enable lazy loading for your website okay this really help for your fast working lazy load google ad adsense ad yes this is also important if your website has uh, uh, the adsense enable it really important to enable the lazy loading for the ads okay when customer lazy loading means customer keep scroll then they are able to see that ad if they just only stay here they will not see uh, the ad will not open properly when they scroll down until they scroll down your ad will be start opening in the down okay this help in performance lazy load for youtube video yeah definitely i want to enable it preload the logo you can uh, enable it i will recommend preload icon fonts yes enable it okay let's click save changes which we have done here important settings for performance let me check our website it has issue if you see any issue in the front page yeah lazy loading already activity it's nice it's fast now okay this is how you can uh, customize your theme i have already uh, share with you important setting if i have uh, if you want to know about other setting here like uh, any specific setting you can let me know in comments next video i can make i will keep making until uh, you learn everything about this thing if you have any um, any query or anything you want to know about if you face any issue in the thing so you can let me know as well i will definitely help you okay so i hope you like this video I really appreciate you really helping me a lot. Please keep watch my videos, subscribe and share my video with your friend. I really appreciate. If you want to, uh, and next video I will bring more. I will I will explain in the detail because here a lot of options we have. We cannot go through uh, step by step in this uh, small time. But I what I said. Uh, just comment me in the video you which category you want to know which setting you want to know so i will definitely make specific uh, special video for you okay thank you so much